Today we're gonna to try out this Mother's New Lens headlight restoration kit. Now, this side looks okay to me. Let's go check out the other light. Now this one, I don't know if it shows up on the camera, is a little more hazy. So what this kit says to do is first, try the Powerball thing here with a nickel size uh, ball of the plastic polish. Try that first. And um, if that's all that's needed, then don't take the more severe steps. Now, if it's lightly hazed or really yellow, then what you're gonna do is you're gonna start with these 800 grit discs. And it's, it's kind of neat. What they do is they give you this Velcro, argh, this thing, and if it's a cordless drill, or if you have one of those impact uh, drills, it's got the hex fitting. So that's clever. It fits nicely into that. So what you would do if they're really severe, which I think on our uh, SUV that is the case, then you do 800 grit, 1500 grit, and then you finally end up with this 3000 grit. Now 3000 grit, if you haven't felt it before, if you would look at it, you wouldn't really think that was sandpaper. It doesn't, but there is a little bit of grit to it, just a real fine grit. So if it's uh, you know more severe, then you go through those steps and then you end up with the plastic polish. Another thing is have a bottle of water uh, handy that you can spray on as you're doing this. And then of course, uh, this non-stick painter's tape. Now, if you can get narrower tape than that, I found it hard to, there's a lot of waste because you're trying to go around bends of the oval light. So if you can get the even narrower tape, that would probably help. So let's give it a try and see what we think. Make sure you shake it first. It's a mess if you don't shake it. So start out slowly. They said start out slowly so it doesn't get all flung around the place. Yeah, so I'm really pleased with the results, actually. I spent all of about four minutes with the Powerball and the plastic polish. Um, make sure to shake that up beforehand. It's really runny initially. And then when you start, you go slowly because the centrifugal force of this is going to fling it all over the place. But I'm really pleased with the way that turned out. It's a little hard to probably see it from that distance, but if you hold a high-intensity light over that one compared to this one, all of a sudden, this one looks like the bad one. I used to think this one was in pretty good shape, so I'm really pleased with that. I did not, not start with the 800 or 1500 or 3000 grit. That's obviously if you have a much more yellowed headlight, but I'm really pleased. This was, I don't know, about $23. I'm really pleased with that kit. And I'm also pleased the cheaper kits, like the 3M, came with little packets that you would tear open of the, of the polish and that's a bit of a pain to deal with. I like the fact that this came with an actual bottle so you can keep that more easily use that in the future. So yeah, pretty pleased with the results. I'm going to try this other one now.